here are a few things you should really know before starting a cleaning business. Now, first thing is customers are actually quite easy to get, especially your first few. And you don't want to make out your new because that puts people on edge. They don't really want to hire new people. Um, putting an ad up will get you some traction in your local area. Even if there's competition, people like to try new people. Um, if you have something new to offer as well, that's quite a good uh, way to go about the ad. And some things you should know is not to price too cheap. I know you've probably heard it a lot and that, but once you get sucked in, you can't really put your price up. And if your price is high, like if you charge $20 for a residential clean per hour and the going rate is 15, you, the person is likely to negotiate. And if they negotiate with you, they think they're getting a good deal. I mean, this is when you go and you give them, give them an estimate of their own home. So don't be afraid to price high. And if they accept it, they accept it, you get a higher deal. So either way, the customer thinks he's won, got a cheap deal. Uh, if he thinks you reduce the price for him as well. So that's a good starting point to know. Now, in terms of equipment, try to use the customer's equipment. Um, in terms of vacuums, mops, bring your own dust and cloths because you're going to go through a lot. Um, use their sprays if you can because these all add up. Track your mileage if you are traveling as well. Um, do go along for an estimate before you actually give a quote if you just say 12 pound an hour and then they call you and they say oh um we want the whole house cleaned in an hour or two you, you ain't going to be able to do it so go give an estimate bring a clipboard take some notes look professional you know you can buy a t-shirt and you, with your logo on it if you want uh it look it looks even better and just go from there i mean the first thing you can do is uh, get your first customer go and visit them don't be disheartened i mean if you're good enough and the customer wants a good clean and you, you can clean good, uh, they'll always recommend you. And then, So just go from there and if you need any help, let me know.